guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new my name's Chandler what's up what's good and welcome back to the clubhouse if this is your first time entering into the clubhouse make sure you guys hit the subscribe button down below because we are always lit over here okay if you're a returning sister hey girl I missed you as you guys read by the title I have teamed up with ilikehair.com to bring you guys this bomb install okay y'all I like it I feel like I'm channeling my inner Meg Thee Stallion y'all remember when she wore like an install or something similar to this I feel like I'm channeling my inner Meg and it's just it's just giving me very much like playful vibes like y'all I love it and yeah so if you want to see my thoughts on this hair so also how I got this color and this style make sure you guys keep on watching okay okay all right y'all so y'all already know before we get into the video we have to get into the box okay so I like hair.com sent me this box full of goodies and I want to thank them so much for reaching out to me inside the box you're gonna get a pamphlet on basically how to take care of your hair as usual they give you a wig cap which was so thin they also give you an eyebrow brush um, which I'm not sure why I guess to lay your baby hairs you also get tweezers and then you also get two clips um these clips do slide so yeah they're not that useful and then you also get a headband which I use all the time to work out it protects my edges and also keeps them laid you know while sweating and whatnot and then you get this shower cap and also in the box of course you're going to get your wig this is the body weight wig that I like hair sent me it is I believe in 22 inches if not check the description box I'll leave it down there and it is that 13 by 6 lace frontal wig okay now I did go in and color this wig I used the same process that I used in my last video except I didn't add the red to it I just used the magenta because I wanted it to be like a plumber color more more plum than red so if you guys want to see exactly how I mix it together the ratios and stuff like that make sure you check out my last video Video, I'll leave it in the card above but yeah you guys can basically watch me color it um it's literally simple I literally slapped it on on the hair y'all know me I slaps color on wigs and keep it moving okay so yeah y'all can vibe out and I'll see you guys whenever um it's time to install it Cause we going down, we on the same way, you the same way, you know I'll be down 
the fist with you Where we going, baby, what's the move? We should take a trip up to the moon Get on, doing my thing, moving too fast Candy paint, we do news all black seats, brown roulette What they gon' say, with the top down, screaming money, anything We up till six in the morning When the sunrise, we'll be on it Boy, I got five, all so live Tell me when to go, baby, when we gon' stop, baby, when we gon' slide to pause and admire how beautiful I look. Like, not to be cocky, but girl, you look the fuck good, okay? Like, since the wig not even laid and you are serving face, the face is sitting. Okay, y'all, back to regular scheduled programs. <laughs> Yeah, they after the boy like fall out. 
whole planet. Drop it, give me 50, girl. Drop it, give me 50. You should slide with me, cause you be tripping when you listen. You gon' hold me close. Okay, so as you guys can see, the lace is a little dark. I tinted it a little bit, but not too much, just because it was already like a medium brown whenever I got it. But um, since it is a little dark, I decided that now was the perfect time to try to do some like low key exotic baby hairs. I've been wanting to try them for the longest, but I just never found like the right look or the right wig to um, do it with. So I figured this was the perfect time to do it. So I am going to go in and attempt, keyword being attempt to do some exotic baby hairs because this is my first try and I think I did pretty good for it to be my first try but you know of course I need more practice So we are here finally um, at the point where we are about to get into the specs of this hair. A lot of you guys probably been waiting on this to hear my opinion whether or not I think it's worth it or not or if I like it. So here it is. This hair was provided by ilikehair.com. It is 180% density, 13 by 6 lace frontal wig. It is in the texture body wave and it is 20 inches. And um, see what had happened was um, the reason why it probably doesn't look 20 inches is because I got a little scissor happy when it came to adding layers to the unit and I may or may not have chopped it up and so I did have to go in and even it out and I think right now it's about a good 18 to 16 inches but when I did receive the wig it was 20 inches so that was 
all my fault for not getting the full 20 inches not the company um also this color the wig did come in a natural brown or black state and i added of course the red like you saw earlier into the into the video it was on a medium cap there was mm, like a good amount of shedding i wouldn't say it was a lot of shedding but it was a good amount of shedding like i probably could have did without half of the shedding that i did get i didn't get any tangling into the hair the hair was very silky very um smooth and i can run my fingers through it now what i can't say about the hair was there was a lot of static like before I added curls to the um to the wig, I did flat iron it first just so I can go in and cut it and add layers and see what I was doing. But when I flat ironed it and was combing the hair, it just was a lot of static. Every time I ran the comb through it, it stood up. Basically, the hair stood up. I wish I would have took a video or a picture of what I'm talking about so you guys can see. But just be mindful that there is a lot of static. It doesn't hinder the wig or make it faulty or whatever like that but if you're somebody who doesn't like static or frizz then you probably wouldn't want this wig also one thing to note is that the knots on the wig were also super big and thick they were so big and thick to the point where I tried to bleach the knots and there was no bleach in the knots it looks good right here but up close you can still see the dark black knots I had to go in with my concealer and kind of cover it up but yeah guys that's all I have for it um all in all I would definitely give it a 8 out of 10 if it wasn't for the black knots it probably would have been much higher but the black knots just stopped me from making it look as natural as it possibly could like I don't know it just was so thick y'all like the knots just took it for me, but like y'all can see here, I'm just concealing the knots that I can see with lighter concealer just to make it look good from far away. Alright guys, so, oh wait, 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 let me put my lip gloss on because what? Girl, I was about to close the video out and the lips wasn't even shining, okay? Alright guys, so this is the end of the video. I did... Okay, my camera died and while it was dying, I went and had some curls and I went and took some pictures and stuff like that. And now that I'm back, my curls have fallen, but it is okay because this is still very much a moment, okay? Okay. So yeah, this is the end of the video. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you all liked what I did with this wig. Like I said, I'm trying to bring new hairstyles to my channel, new colors, new everything, new content with consistency. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you are not a part of the clubhouse, I think that's what we're gonna use. If you are not a part of the clubhouse, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below as well as turn on your post notification right next to it. Hit the bell right next to the subscribe button so you can turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out on any of my new uploads. Like I said, join the clubhouse because over here at the clubhouse, we keep it cute, we keep it bougie, and we keep it ratchet, okay? I also wanna give a big heartfelt thank you to ilikehair.com to ilikehair.com for sponsoring this video and sending me over this wig so that way I can give my honest review of this hair. You guys can also check out my code um, Chandler20. I'll leave it right here also in the description box below as well as all the links to this hair and all the products that I use to achieve this look. You guys can find that in the description bar. Make sure you guys are checking it out because literally sometimes the questions that you guys ask me in the comments they're in the description bar and so sometimes if I don't respond to you in the comments it's because the question you ask me is in the description bar. Um, I will see you all in my next video and subscribe because <laughs> why not? Sunrise will be on it.
who I got from, also live. Tell me when I go, baby, where we gon' stop, baby, where we gon' stop.